Hey traders, David Frost, LazyGapTrader.com. In this video, we're talking about day trading. More specifically, we're talking about gap trading and how gap trading is by far the single most consistent and profitable day trading strategy you're gonna find across the markets today. What I do is a couple of things. The first thing and most importantly is I teach a course where I teach traders everything they need to know about gap trading. There are two strategies taught within the course. The first one are the morning gap trades. That's when stocks are gapping higher or lower at the open, which creates an opportunity for traders. The opportunity is for traders that can identify a specific price level where stocks will first be drawn to and then have a price reaction from in the other direction. What traders learn is exactly how to identify those specific price levels. The other strategy in the course is known as the gap fill strategy. When stocks do gap higher or lower at the open, it creates what's called an open gap. Most of the time, open gaps will be filled at some point in the future. I teach traders how we track them, I give my traders the tools to track them, and I teach my traders how to trade them. As we know, not all trades are created equal, therefore, we must understand which trades are viable at the time they come into the specific price level. All that is taught in great detail in the course at Lazy Gap Trader. The other thing I do is give traders an opportunity to get my gap trades sent to them each and every day at 9 o'clock a.m. Eastern Standard Time, 30 minutes before the markets even opened for business. Here's the email that went out this morning at 9 o'clock a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Actually, this was the second transmission. There was a correction because I made a mistake. I'm human like everybody else. And the best part about what I teach and what traders learn throughout my course is that they get very good at calculating these levels. And one trader this morning notified me immediately that I had an incorrect number and therefore I corrected it, resent the email to everybody else so that they had the proper numbers to start the trading day. And that's what this is all about. It's about learning and put what you learn to work, apply it each and every day. And the end goal is very simple to make money trading the gaps. So this morning we had six possible morning gap trades on the board and two of them came into their price levels producing tradable opportunities. When a stock does not come into its price level, it's off the board, it's a no trade. We only want to trade the high probability trades or price levels that we calculate which produces the high probability trades. We're going to take a look at the charts in detail of the two stocks that did hit their price levels today. The first one was LOGI, Logitech International. I say gap lower. Support levels are 36.50, 3434, and then I even give a third level at 3218. Stop and profit target is about 25 to 45 cents. These are minimum profit targets. The second stock that came into its price level today was IPG, Interpub Group. Gap lower, support levels are 22.16 and $20.97. Stop and profit target is about 20 to 40 cents. Again, minimum profit targets. The rest of the stocks did not hit their price levels. Some came close, but we only want the high probability premium trades. Before we go over to the charts, I'll show you that also included in this email is a list of gap fill trades that are approaching their gap fill levels. And at the time I make this video, there's a couple more that are approaching their gap fill levels. But let's go over to the charts and look at the two stocks that did hit their morning gap levels. The first one we'll look at is IPG. You can see where the stock closed yesterday at $25.59, was gapping lower at the open, opening the day at $23.44, and began to trade lower. You can see what happened as soon as the stock hit the $22.16 level, making a low of $22.14, just two pennies below the level that was calculated at 9 o'clock in the morning before the opening bell even rung. As soon as it hit that level, 
Just within minutes, the stock was at a high of $22.55, representing a $0.39 cent potential gain in just a matter of minutes. It's exactly what we were looking for. In fact, it's more than we were looking for. It's the exact scalp trade we were looking for. When stocks come into these specific levels that we calculate, we're looking for a price reaction in the other direction. That's precisely what we got. Then you can see the stock traded slightly lower and now has come back over the 2216 and even already made a high of 2296 and potentially could go higher throughout the trading day. There's absolutely no reason that any trader can't learn this method. It's clear, it's concise, it works, and it's a fantastic strategy that you can use each and every day for the rest of your trading career. Let's go ahead and take a look at the other stock, LOGI. As you can see, Logitech closed yesterday at $40.73, opening today's session at $38.22 and traded lower. Now this one is slightly different and this one was not an easy trade because of the way it came into the price level. In the course, I teach specifically what happens when a stock comes close, bounces higher, then comes into the price level, or what we call consolidates above the price level, for example. It changes the probability of the trade. However, you can see the power of these price levels. The $36.50 level was the level that was calculated that any trader that's taken the course was able to calculate. It came into the price level, traded slightly lower right against the stop loss limitation and then bounced higher. Now it ended up giving the type of gain we were looking for, making a high of 37.07 thus far today. But before bouncing higher, the stock headed towards what we call the even number of 36 and then reversed higher. And this is a little tidbit for traders. Stocks like the even numbers. Stocks will most of the time pierce through an even number and reverse or come up to the even number and reverse. Any way you look at it, you can see the power of these price levels that you're taught how to calculate in the course at Lazy Gap Trader. Anybody can learn this strategy and it's a strategy that you can use for the rest of your trading career. I'm David Frost, Lazy Gap Trader. Thanks for tuning in, folks.